I am going to discuss some numericals uh, from chapter 2 and very simple numericals and it may contain so one or two marks uh, let's discuss the first numerical uh, that is uh, a question that is asked that diameter of a spherical conductor uh, already we have discussed that what is a spherical conductor and its capacitance now it's given that the diameter of a spherical conductor is one meter okay now what is its capacity so diameter is given so you have to find out the radius so this is a very simple formula radius is the half of the diameter so 0 0.5 meter now what is the capacitance already we discussed the capacitance of a spherical conductor so this was the formula now 4 pi epsilon naught r okay so 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught equal to 9 into 10 to the power 9 so 4 pi epsilon naught can be written as 9 into 10 to the power 1 by 9 into 10 to the power 9 and just put these values this is the radius and you will get the <coughs> capacitance now the unit of capacitance is farad then the smaller units are picofarad microfarad nanofarad all these things so you can see here the 55.5 10 to the minus 12 farad so 10 to the minus 12 farad equal to 1 picofarad so it can be written as 55.5 picofarad okay now let's move to the second uh, numerical uh, calculate the capacitance of a parallel condenser of two plates uh, 100 centimeter into 100 centimeter is separated by 2 mm uh, thick glass sheet okay now the most important thing is that um, here uh, there is a parallel capacitor okay of two plates and this is given this is the area okay so 100 centimeter 100 centimeter this is the area in centimeter square now in between the uh, plates a glass sheet is placed of thickness 2 mm so it looks like that there is no vacuum or air in between the plates so that what is my glass sheet as a glass sheet of my k equal to 4 so what is the k there is a dialectic constant okay so the one that i dialectic at a plate that has a capacitor to the plate or mother to vacuum air and so we cannot use the general formula that is already we used in case of him uh, if air or vacuum is placed inside the um, uh, plates of the condenser now there is a dielectric material is placed so there is a glass of dielectric constant k equal to 4 so what is the formula first you have to calculate the area of the plates so area of the plate here 100 into 100 centimeter so 10 to the 4 centimeter square hoy. so it can be written as 1 meter square if you want to convert so it can be converted to me so 10 to the 4 centimeter square to 1 meter square it's very simple so now the separation between the plates that is in mm that is millimeter so you have to convert it to the SI unit just convert it to into 10 to the minus 3 meter so k is the four that is very important dielectric constant now what is the capacitance so it is to see so it is a dielectric material without the it formula so the vacuum the a to the epsilon r a to the dielectric constant by relative parmi tv tv so we are able to one with so it is a vacuum by air to place the vitro but there is not a kid today able to one no it is not you one actually it takes some other values so epsilon r can be written as k take a set of formulas k equal to k value to 1 4 epsilon non vitro to be done 8.85 to the minus 12 a means this d equal to this just put all the values and you will get the value of the capacity okay so all right as a key the capacitor of a capacitor becomes 10 microfarad when air between the places is placed okay by a dielectric of k equal to 2 so you have money key which is to my bottom red at the capacity of the type of air by the commas as it will be because of the time before the done way are you are you should use it to my he did to dial the inner plate to us with a little more sorry the capacitor plate as a type of my key goes to dial the plate that is what are to my dial the constant given that is true okay so it here goes as a 10 microwave with it now what is the capacity of the condenser with air in between the place so air to go to the time on the one with the air as it is it here to my key as it is our capacitance given away do it to simple formula I come in the key on air to get to my capacity from like you want to see equal to epsilon not a by d to see not please are are the debellic material to get the key on my epsilon not are epsilon not a by d it was a I don't know it was right there so you have to marry at a ratio low by epsilon are money key key okay so it's your room is a little lower then key hobo k can be written as cm by c no so what is cm cm is the capacity of a parallel plate capacitor when some dielectric slab or other material place in between the plates and a c not to key high 
the capacity of a parallel plate capacitor when uh, air or vacuum is placed in between the plates so k can be written as cm by c naught so it we already discussed with so more previous video tumi saw para ki ase bostu bilak so just put the value here c naught equal to cm by k hobo so cm kiman hoy jay 10 microfarad jodi directly slab tumi di diyo k value 2 di ase so jeti air thake tetia kiman hobo capacity here uliya bodi so you have to find out the value of c naught that is 5 microfarad okay so now at case of three capacitors in the capacitor is 1 microfarad, 2 microfarad and 3 microfarad are joined in series so how many times will the capacity become when they are joined in parallel so what about series are joined by then you have to find out the equivalent capacitance then you have to connect all the capacitors in parallel parallel connect all then again you have to find out the uh, the value of the final capacitance okay so what about you guys so series of capacitor formula to 1 by cs equal to 1 by c so just put the all the values so all are in microfarad so final uh, the equivalent capacitance will be also in microfarad. So 1 by CS means 11 by 6. So here is the important thing. What is the 1 by CS to the value pi here to equivalent capacitance? Because this is more than that. But actually, it is not. 1 by CS is value here to 11 by 6. So CS is equal to 6 by 11. So 6 by 11 in series. Connection. So here is the value of 6 by 11. Now, if parallel is parallel to direct, this is the formula. CP equal to C1 plus C2 plus C3. Just put all the value 6 microfarad. So, card value is a parallel combination code. It is a capacity basis. Like so, capacity basis means it can store more cells. Okay. So, now calculate energy stored in the capacitor of 5 microfarad when it is charged to a potential of 250 volt. Okay. So, the TIA at the capacitor of 250 volt will charge. The capacitor of 5 microfarad. So, what energy is stored? So, what is the C value is the microfarad of the V value is volt of the So, microfarad of the to convert. Kora. So, it's 5 into 10 to minus 6 farad. V equal 250 volt. Then, what is the E? So, C or V is So, we have to use this formula. Half C V square. So, the energy stored formula is both the same. It's already equal to the L2. So, here we have to use C V value of C or V value of the C. Now, we have to use the Q V formula to use the but QC is the QC formula. We have discussed this in our class. So, we will see the video in the numerical class. So, just put the values now and you will get the energy. So, what is the SI unit of energy? That is Joule. So, this is a very simple problem. So, if you have 1 but 2 marks, you will get the concept to know. So, this formula is already done. So, what is the important problem? This is the problem. This is the most important thing. The capacitor is the same. प्लेट और मास्टर जितिया तुम्हारे बेलेग मटेरियल ली दिया है और जितने एयर ठेके तो इतिहास दूसरा मतलब कैपेसिटर्स की मान है ये तो इन वाला प्रॉब्लम बहुत बार है इसे तो आमी ऑलरेडी जाना ये तो होगा तो केस जो डायरेक्टली कांस्टेंट ठीक है से तो ये ये बस तो बुझी बोले मोर जितने प्रीवियस वीडियो ये तो सब वाले ही